Hello everyone and welcome back to my Legis Cut. What? I mean Suikel Gaiden, Volume 1, The Swordsman of Harmonia. This is Ben Reed. And Gerard Simi. The men who had cut my right leg. I immediately whirled around to return down the path I had come, but another man blocked my way. The guy with the voice looks like this. A long time no see. <laughs> I can't take it seriously! <laughs> It's just so much fun to do that every time I have to do it, it makes me laugh. We were in such a rush last time. Stop laughing! Stop laughing! my voice! Stop it! I'm afraid I wasn't able to introduce myself. Stop it! Swallow before you spit that soda out! Are you done? No! Hello. Okay. 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 <laughs> I'm afraid I wasn't able to introduce myself properly. I am Colgan, the commander of the Fourth Highland Army. Stop it! <laughs> Why are you laughing, Gavin? <laughs> We've finally caught up with you. Crying. Sorry. <laughs> You've made us work quite hard for this. You're quite the persistent one yourself. <laughs> Don't you have better things to do than follow me around? <laughs> sure, if you are no more than a common thief. But a Harmonian spy is an entirely different story. The Highland and Harmonia are allies. If you kill me, it won't create diplomatic issues. Won't it create diplomatic issues between the Octo countries? Hey, 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 that's my voice. Stay that's out the of least this. of your concerns. Stay out of my voice territory. It's pretty easy to do now, though. Yeah, well, then stop. Before I realized that the other man had come up behind me and swung his sword. I spun around, but my injured leg impeded, impeded my movement, and I was unable to completely dodge his sword, giving me a fresh wound on my left arm. You're as light as on your feet as ever. It was by the request of a high-ranking Harmonian officer that we came all this way. It would seem that your situation is quite complex, hmm? A high-ranking Harmonian officer? Dun, dun, what in the world dun. is he talking about? Only the captain of the garrison is supposed to know my infiltration mission here. Your right leg, your left arm, what's next? You're Mr. Charlatan! Charlatan, huh? What was that, your attempt at a joke? You could say that. Well then, why not try this one on for size? I added a one, but whatever. I slip a flash bomb into the palm of my right hand, and a throwing knife into my left. Take this! Make it make his voice more Just as I attempt to set off the flash bomb, Seed knocked it out of my hand with a single strike of a sword. Jeez. Well, what now? No, no, not like that. Um, but what now? Oh, Enough what? of your clever little tricks. Like that. Why? J try it. <laughs> I think his voice. Is He's just that. toying with me. But even so, it doesn't look like there's any chance of me escaping this time. For a moment, the thought of releasing the swords on my back fills my head, but I desperately resist the temptation. Fine. If you want to fight this out to the bitter end, I'll be your opponent. So you finally come around. There's no need us to lead us on this wild chase to get here. I was thinking more like... Tristan Taylor? Yeah, I know. I can't do that once. Yeah. I have a few firebombs that I hadn't used in the fight with Elza, and the golden wolf in my right side, and the, alright, some throwing knives in my left, darts in my right gauntlet, and the wired anchor in the left. I'll be alright. Let's do this! Yes, you can. Just go, like, before you have to do his voice, go, the sun will be up soon, and you should be able to get it. Hmm. Your expression has changed. It seems you're finally ready to be serious about this. Now face me! Mm. Can't take that voice. Take this! Fading a leap, I backstep and throw a firebomb with my right hands, but it'll detonate right in their faces. How? A limo. Water room. He has a water room? Apparently. I'm a water user. Look. Hogan called upon the magic of his water room, and the firebomb extinguished. Anticlimatically, well, that's what fell to the ground. Well, if that's how you're gonna be.
I immediately threw a knife with my left hand, but Seed parried it with ease. However, I was counting on that. It was time to set up the shot of my favorite dart. Thunder Rune, strike down my enemy. You don't have to, bullshit. Okay. Lightning shot from Kogan's left hand, and amidst the blinding brilliance, well, Seed lunged forward to strike with surprising force. A synchronized sword and magic attack. Even if I was able to dodge the sword, I'd be fried to a crisp by the magic attack. I endured the magic, I'd be stabbed with the sword. Fantastic. <laughs> I absorbed the impact with my arms, leaving them numb. Gripping the earth talisman with my hand. Oh, nice! I used my left arm to absorb the light well, lightning strike and used my right gauntlet to defend against the sword's blow. I wasn't out of the frying pan just yet. Rather, it might be more accurate to say that I was falling into the fire. I only had the strength to fend off one more attack at best. What, is that all you've got? I thought you'd be- I thought you'd last long. God, he's like one sexual joke after another. This certainly is something of a disappointment, especially considering everything the Harmonian officer told us about you. Does he have some kind of grudge against you? Why was his name again? The guy. He, he called, called himself, himself Zaj. Oh, damn. <laughs> he was quite a fellow, but when it came to you, he was surprisingly vindictive. Yeah. Oh! Danger, Will Robinson, danger! What? What did you just say? I said his name was Zaj. Hard of hearing. Why keep changing his voice? He said the information from a harmonian called Zaj. But enough chit chat. Here I go. Haha! <laughs> -ha. Slash! Aha! Crossing both my arms, I stopped Seed's attack by blocking with the gauntlets on my arms. You can have to say arm to it. Z J That's ridiculous. Because I obviously... Shit. Those gauntlets are surprisingly tough. But the next one will be the last. Let's go, Colgan. Absolutely. <laughs> They're this coming. This voice is the best If they voice. hit me with that simultaneous magic and sword attack again, there's no way I'll survive. But, Zaj. He's closing the distance between us with stunning speed. Colgan's rune is shining, but my mind's calm. It isn't simply free of idle thoughts. I've gone beyond feelings and simply feeling nothing at all anymore. I'll be breaking the oath I've made, but I have to live. They said Zaj. Oh my if god. If it's him... What? Okay, that was obviously, he was obviously the guy in the fancy suit with the glasses. Oh, I mean, unless he's the woman. Mm, seems unlikely. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Seems Giving just a little into unlikely. Into the temptation of the swords on my back, I made my move. My hands unconsciously reached for and unfastened their clasps. There goes the swords. And my right hand is Schwartz. And my left is Weiss. Slowly, they, slow, they slid out of the sheaths they'd been sealed in. Okay, quick. What's, what does the German Schwartz mean? Schwartz? Yeah. I'm going to Google it. Continue. I'll it's over. Schwartz! <laughs> Holy shit, Nash. What he now? Is, he is angry. Weiss! <laughs> he repelled the lightning? Fantastic. What the devil are those? When I wield these swords, it no longer matter to me who lives and who dies. And vowed never to use them again. And throw them away. And perhaps that will prove to be my downfall. In the name of the Lechet family, in the name of the dual snake swords, cross our floss! I wielded a sword in each hand, and memories of taking Sandlord came flooding back. Memories that I'd sealed away. Shit! What the hell is this? Oh, no, you have to go like this. Be careful. Those swords aren't just made for killing. That was not the right voice. No, it wasn't. I already know that. Ah! 
with Schwartz with my right hand, I make a grand sweeping attack, but it's easily avoided. However, that was just a feint. Gripped in my left hand, Weiss shot out. Though it's a blade, if the reason it's called one of the dual snake swords is so that it can extend itself. Seed barely manages to defend himself from mine, as expected. Shit! That was close. If you're this good with a sword, then why didn't you just use one from the beginning? I flick my wrist and draw the fully extended vice back into a blade to repel Seed's counterattack. But Hogan appeared from my blind spot and sword at the ready. He tried to stab me in the throat, but a swing of Schwartz in my right hand easily deflected him. This technique proves quite the defense. There it is. Yeah, my <laughs> fuck. How do I do it? <laughs> it's been too long since I've encountered a foe who could put up a decent fight. This is great! He's insane. You don't have no idea how to head with that dude. Here, just give me this. So just give me <laughs> I twist my wrist and block, and both Swords and Weiss are back on the sword forms. This is it. I kick up some dirt and rush between the two of them, striking them both at the same time. Kogan managed to avoid Weiss, but Swords' blade made contact with the sea. Form once again and whip like twisted around the blade that seed had been about to attack with. Ah! Seed lost his sword and jumped back to avoid Schwartz's attack, but my efforts had hadn't been for nothing. Seed! Ah, I'm fine. It's just grazed my chest. Ugh. Sita just started to get up and fell down on one knee. Schwartz's deadly poison had already made contact. His sword was so broken. Too bad. Well done. That was the hardest text message I'd ever have to compose in my life. I raised the swords high over my head and twisted my body, but I tripped and stumbled. My left foot is slick with blood. Seed hadn't broken my defense, but when he was being hit by Swartz, he'd managed to cut my leg with a dagger that he had in his left hand. Shit! He only just now noticed in his inner monologue. And I had made it so far. The poison should be coursing through Seed's system by now, but that still left Colgan. Without the use of both legs, I have no chance of winning against him. Just as I feared, Colgan approached me. My whole body is shaking as I try to gather the strength into my hands to repel his sword once again, but I ended up with a sword in my throat. Shit, see this hopeless sometimes. Shit, see it is hopeless sometimes. You don't fight that recklessly against an enemy you don't fully understand. So now you're gonna kill me on his behalf? Well, that would please me. You're only one who would know about the antidote. And give it to me. And I will spare your life. Won't take me at my word. In the inner pocket of my coat, on the right hand side, is a green bottle. This one. Do you trust me? The only guarantee I can offer is that it really is the antidote, is my word. If you've lied to me, I'll strike you down. And that's no threat. It's the truth, plain and simple. Hogan pulled out the antidote and, letting go of me, returned to Seed's side and had him drink it. The effect won't be immediate apparent. Immediately, immediately apparent. apparent. Carrying the still unconscious Seed, Hogan mounted his horse. We we'll call this, this match a draw. Right. This match, huh? Risking my life over a match. I'll pass, thanks. Is that so? Then I suggest you leave this land as soon as you recover. It won't be long before Greenhill becomes a battlefield too. Thanks for the advice, but I still have my mission. Do as you wish. 
till we meet again. <laughs> Hair flip. <laughs> I kind of imagine the same thing too. But Seed has the hair to do that with. Yeah, but Colgan has the voice. <laughs> with those words, they made their Only exit. because of me. Somehow, somehow I managed to survive yet again. I was overcome with joy. Oh, oh, except <sighs> now I'm going to pass out from blood loss. Yay! <laughs> Come Sprawled on the ground, I gazed up at the sky. Clouds floated by, being carried whatever the wind Wherever. took them. Shut up. Just like my future. Luck. <laughs> That's fantastic. Like I said, every time I get hit, I get a luck. Yeah. Every time. And this is the end of chapter. Yes, I would like to. Three. So that will. Well, as soon as I'm done saving, obviously. Yeah. Um. And to my knowledge, although y'all can correct me if I'm wrong, I don't see a particular translation for the German word for. Although I'm aware that um, Weiss is white, so it's kind of interesting to see where that well, goes. Well, we'll see next time on Suiko Gaiden, Volume 1, the last episode. This is Ben is Ryu. And Kurohane Shizumi. Till next time. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>